Since there's a lot of people that want to be pro right away, here's the quickest guide I can give you. Starting off with crab walking. This is performed by moving your arm parallel to the floor in any direction. Then go in the opposite way very quickly to confuse your opponent. This is also known as breaking somebody's ankle. The corner fake. This is performed by going partially around a tree, then strafing to the opposite side around them to confuse them. Surface bouncing. This is performed by running towards the surface, jumping into it, then pushing in a random direction to confuse your opponent. Standing still. No, I I'm not even kidding. This actually works. C kind of. Floor bouncing. The most overrated TikTok juke in existence, which is performed by running in a straight line and pushing down and back to make them run right past you. The slide swing. This is performed by running towards a slide, sticking your right hand up and through it, then extending your right to the right as you move your body to push out, which this can also be done on your left hand. Base swinging. Now this can be performed in two different ways, with one hand or with two hands. With one, you extend and stick your hand through a base, then do a horizontal circular motion in real life, then push out. With two, you grab a base, do a random three 360 and push yourself in a random direction. The rag spin. This was a juke originally created by that Tumis, which requires you to jump onto the center of a branch, tilt your head to reduce your hitbox, hold your arm up, and turn 180 degrees in real life, then propel yourself. <laughs> Elevator gliding. To perform this juke, you must know how to elevator climb, but essentially you elevator climb up and forward until you reach the end of the wall. Then turn yourself 90 degrees in real life, push forward, and put yourself back into another elevator climb position. The gazebo swing. To do this, you must go to the back of a gazebo, push off the board towards the roof, tilt your head to reduce your hitbox, and reach your hand to push yourself on top of the roof. The dead walk. This is executed by tilting your head 45 degrees downward, dive under a bridge with your hand above it, and scuttle your hands until you reach the other side to propel yourself. Tree scaling. This is for much more advanced players that already know how to branch and wall run, but this is performed by vertical forward wall climbing up a tree and using the branches around the tree to elevate yourself upwards and disorientate lava monkeys. The treehouse swing. This is performed by getting on top of the treehouse, going towards the window, getting into an elevator climb position, and going around it to the front. Wall running. Before you say anything, yes, this can be used in juking. Let me explain. To wall run, you need to stand parallel to the wall, then push down and into the wall to elevate. The way you can juke people is by direction switching. As you're wall running, use unpredictable patterns until you juke them out. The roof swing. This was a juke created by J-Man. The way to perform this is going under the gazebo, jumping up and spread your arms apart in between the planks, then push yourself down and around until you push yourself on top of the roof. Creativity. The final tip I have for you all is to get creative with juking. Don't do everything the exact same way or people will catch you. Just remember the environment and you is your best chance at survival. And always remember to have fun. Hope you guys enjoyed. Peace out.